Hey, are we lost? Where are we? This place is weird. It looks like a forest, but it feels like something's wrong. Uh, hey guys, look, I think there's a note here. Father, then look and read what it says. For some reason, I have this strange feeling that we're not alone here. That this forest holds some kind of secret. Maybe we didn't come here for nothing. But we have to find our way. Oh my god, Dad, oh no! Oh my god, what happened? Oh no, it's a trap, it's an ambush. We have to get out of here. They're our husbands. We can't just leave them here. Oh my god, oh no, JJ, run! Our parents, they've all been wiped out. Oh my god, Mikey, we're in danger. Uh, then why are we standing here? Let's get out of here before they destroy us too. Oh no, let's look over there. I think we're in trouble. Are we done now? No, this cannot be. Why us? Someone help us. Oh my god. What do we do now that we're in such danger? Jay, why aren't they attacking us? Look at this. They're standing there like they want something from us. Maybe they need us somehow. Yes, they do. Cars, you're right. If they need us, they won't attack us. They probably want us to go somewhere with them. Hey, I don't want to do that. I think we should get out of here. If we run, they'll start shooting at us. Hey, you filthy skeletons. Get out of here before it's too late. Don't worry, kids. You'll be all right. We'll protect you. Wow! Giant talking zombies. I can't believe it. Oh, we wanted to thank you for saving us. But we have a problem. It's your parents. That's terrible. But what were you doing here? We got lost in the woods, and then we were attacked. Now we have nowhere to go, and our parents... We can't just leave you here. This is a very dangerous place, and whoever comes in here will be dinner for skeletons. So if you want to come with us, because we have a safe place. Ah, especially since it's starting to rain. We have to hurry before they get wet and sick. Well, the choice is yours. Uh, if you want to come with us. <laughs> if you're afraid, you'll be lunch for the skeletons. JJ, go with them. It's our only chance to survive. We don't mind, really. So thank you very much again. You don't have to be afraid of us. You can trust us because if we wanted to eat you or something, we would have done it a long time ago, but there's no point in wasting our time. Especially look at our shelter. We live near water and it's safe enough here. Are there a lot of monsters here? Mostly skeletons. They're kind of wild and attack anything that moves. Well, there's a place further down in the cave where you can sit and sleep. So don't be shy and feel safe. Ah! Thank you again for saving us. We can't thank you enough for that. JJ is very cozy here. I love it. Thank you guys again, but we don't know how to survive anymore. You're not going away. You can stay with us and live here. I'll teach you some crafting skills. Or maybe you know how to create resources and items on the workbench. No, we tried it once, but unfortunately we don't know the recipes. Ah. Well then, follow me. I'll show you a place where you can get some practice. Uh, we're gonna make new things? That's right. Well, look what I've got here. There's a workbench where you can create objects. And you can see all kinds of recipes for these items. You have plenty of time, so if you want, you can try to create something now. If you're tired and need to rest, go to sleep. Make yourself at home. All right. Thank you again for such a warm welcome. We'll try to create some items here. Here you go. Grab your resources and try to lay out on the workbench exactly what you see on the walls. There's swords and axes and all sorts of other stuff. So go ahead. There's a chest behind you. My name is Adam, by the way. What's yours? I'm JJ. This is my friend Mikey. Thanks again for saving us. No problem. My wife's name is Gabriella. We don't have names because we're zombies, but that's what we call each other. What am I supposed to do with these pieces of iron? JJ, huh? So JJ, you go to the workbench and create exactly what's on your left. Your job is to create the helmet. It's a simple matter of putting pieces of iron on top of the helmet. Then you need chest armor. That's gonna take a lot of iron. And then just make your pants and your boots. And don't forget to do the same for Mikey. Whoa, I like this. It's really nice and useful. You see how easy it is to make things when you have a recipe, so there's nothing complicated about it? Yes, it's really fun. Cool. Now we're going to have gear, right? Yes. You can carry all this stuff with you. They should last you a long time. 
Come on, Mikey. Hey, you. Stop running around like that. Jay, give me all the gear you built for me. You'll need the armor to protect you from physical damage. Oddly enough, ha 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 ha. Like it's supposed to protect you from skeleton arrows, I guess. We don't care about that because we have tough skin. Yes, I've seen how scared of you skeletons are. But we'd like to create more weapons and tools. Uh, let's start with a sword. Two bars and a stick at the bottom. Go, JJ, get to work. Hey, Mikey, what are you gonna do? Run around like a clown and just watch. Come on, help me out too. Come on, JJ, don't show off because you have a lot of work to do. Yes, you need a sword to fight off the enemy, a pickaxe to dig up useful resources in the rocks, an axe to chop down logs and stakes. And there's something else I don't remember what it is for gardening and digging up earth. We have so much time ahead of us that we'll find a use for these things. Thanks again, Adam. Hey, Mikey, why are you so sad? I made these presents for you too, so grab them and we can test them out later. Thanks, JJ. I'm just sad about the way things turned out. The most important thing is that we survived and somehow we'll destroy those skeletons. Oh, wow. I wouldn't recommend it because there's too many of them and you don't want to do anything rash. It's too early for you to do this, but you need to get some sleep now, so go to your seats and feel safe. Tomorrow, we'll think about what we can do. I've got a lot of ideas, actually, so get some rest. You've done so much for us. It's made me uncomfortable, frankly. I don't know why you're helping us, big guy. Thanks to all of you, and especially you, big dude. We'll never forget this, so have a good night's sleep. Well, let's get some sleep now, because we need to get our strength back. Listen, I didn't realize this place would be so comfortable, and my back's fine. Shh, so don't disturb my sleep. Well, sleep then. I'll sleep then, too. Ah, my stomach. I'm so hungry. Me, too. I'm so hungry. Hey, guys, I hear you're hungry. Well, then let us feed you. There's no... Oh, <laughs> it's just rotting flesh. They're, they don't eat that. Ah, yes. Unfortunately, if we eat it, we'll turn into vegetables. That's okay. We'll go to the woods and find some food. Nope. You're not going anywhere alone because it's dangerous. We know what to do, so come with us. We're going to a village not far from here. Maybe the villagers there can help us. Wow. Are you friends with the villagers? No. We're trying to stay out of their sight so they don't get mad at us. Let's go. Come with us. It's not far. Whoa. How long have we been walking for? Long enough, I think? <sighs> not much longer. Aha, I forgot something. We're not just going there to get supplies, we're going there to buy supplies. So I'm gonna give you a bunch of iron to trade for supplies. We could just steal the supplies, but okay. Ha, huh. let's do whatever you say, Adam. Stealing is wrong and ugly. You don't have to stoop to that, we gonna do fair. Hmm, well, they villagers must have some kind of food. The kind we eat. Well, here we are, Sar. This is the village. Hey, man, we brought you some stuff. Would you mind giving it to us? <laughs> <laughs> now he's scared of you. Yeah. It happens all the time, and we're used to it. But now you have food because he dropped something. Great. Now we can go back, right? Nope. That's not fair. So I'm giving you a bunch of iron bars. We'll have to go to them and ask them for food and give them these bars in return. Adam, even though you're a giant zombie, you have a very kind heart. I'm amazed. Have my son go with you so that villager doesn't get scared of you. Okay. Hey, villager, open the door. Hmm, who the hell is that? Hey, we brought you something. Oh my God, it's a zombie giant. Don't eat me, please. Oh no. Ha 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 that was funny, but why are they all scared of you? All right, villager. You should be thanked for helping us. Now, let's go back to our place. It looks like there's nothing more for us to do here. What's up? Did you make it? That villager just fainted and lost consciousness. It was kind of funny. Hey, who the hell are you guys? I hear you're hurting the villagers. Oh my god, we don't want any trouble. So, let's get out of here. Hey, I just wanted to talk to you. You don't have to do this. Oh my god, he's gaining on us. I can see it's getting dark and it's not normal because it's dangerous. Don't worry, kids. 
We'll be home now and everything will be okay. Oh no, oh my god! Jay and Mikey, run! We're gonna make it on our own and come back to you. Save yourselves! Uh, no! We can't just leave them here! Oh my god! It's the skeletons! Looks like we're trapped again! JJ and Mikey, I said run! Get to safety now! Well then, let's run, JJ! Let's go to our hideout! We need to figure out a way to save our friends! He's right! We have to save ourselves because we can't beat them now! Oh my god, this is just awful! I don't want them to suffer too! We have to save them! Yeah, I understand that, but how do we save them? I don't know. Go and free them, destroy the skeletons, and save our boys. Yes, but we're gonna need better equipment for that. Adam was right. Adam can try to fight them, but it won't last long. That's why we need to search the shelter and find better gear. Let's take a look around. Hey, Mikey, let's go look in that place. Maybe we can find something useful in there. JJ, we've been here before. Why are we back here again? Because, Mikey, I think there might be a secret in here somewhere. Do you realize that? Uh, a secret? Like a secret room with some kind of equipment in it? I'm not sure about that, but yeah. If we search the cave carefully, we might be able to find some diamond equipment that is much stronger than what we have now. Uh-oh, JJ! I don't see anything useful in here yet, so I don't even know where we're gonna find any of this stuff. It can't be Mikey. There's got to be something in here. Maybe some kind of secret lever or button. Just take a closer look. Yeah, I found Mikey. What, JJ? What did you find? A lever. There's a lever. We have to activate it, right? I guess so. And then some secret room will open up? Well, let's have a look. I'm hoping it'll do something to help us in the battle ahead. Whoa! You were right. There really is a secret room in here. Whoa. Uh, it's so mysterious? We have three chests, and which one do we open? Well, let's try this chest. Nope, iron. I understand that we don't need it because we already have it. Yes, we need much better equipment. Something that's really strong and can take a lot of damage. Uh, let's take a look at this chest over here. What have we got here? Hmm, <laughs> gold is a valuable resource, but unfortunately, gold armor is one of the worst in terms of effectiveness. It's easier for us to go without armor than in it. Uh, you're right. We should look at the last chest. There must be something valuable in it after all, right? Whoa! That's exactly what we need. Diamonds! There's so many of them! Mikey, don't be greedy. We came here to get stronger gear, not to steal valuables. Uh, that's all well and good. But I wish we didn't have to fight. We need to find another way. Yeah, Mikey, you're right. It'll be a lot more effective if we don't fight. So come on. We need to get ready and get back to that spot. I don't think they stayed there. You think they could have been taken with them and taken somewhere? The tracks led us to this exact spot. Mikey, look! We came in the right direction after all. Uh, oh no, are you sure they're here? Yeah. They were kidnapped and brought here. I just don't understand how that's possible. I don't understand it either. But what now? What do we do now? I have a plan. We can still use stealth. Hmm? I don't understand you. What if we dig an underground tunnel and then try to use it to get to our friends? Hmm. Why? That's an interesting idea, actually. I like it. I just don't want to fight them. Sometimes it's better to use your brain than to go for it. Is for that. Right here. So what? The tunnel will then lead straight to them? Well, I hope so. I don't know exactly where they are, but we'll dig forward, because the cave is in that direction. Then I'll keep an eye out to make sure no one comes in here. Nom, 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 nom. So how's it going in there? I don't know. I'm digging a tunnel and I see rocks, so we're already in the cave. They must be around here somewhere. Yeah, there you are. Hey, Adam, it's me, JJ. Get over here now. Jay, how did you... Oh my god, what are you doing here? How did you find us? Follow the tracks. Rotten flesh, you led us right into this cave. Now it's my turn to save your bodies, so let's go. Come on, JJ. Thank you. Go to the tunnel and wait for us at home. I'm not finished here a little bit because I want to do something. Just don't stay long. We do not want to save you again for the second time. 
I still want revenge on those. Ah, those dirty skeletons for what they did to our families. Now they can never live here again. Cause I'm gonna blow this whole place up and there'll be nothing left. Then maybe these skeletons will stop showing up in the woods or even disappear. That's what they want. Take that you filthy mutants. Everybody disperse. There's gonna be a very loud explosion. <laughs> that was a blast. Hey JJ, looks like you did a good deed. Come here and take a look. What's going on here, Mikey? What happened? There was a cave-in and now the skeleton cave doesn't exist anymore. Maybe we stopped them somehow. Maybe they won't even come into the woods anymore. Ah, looks like you saved us. Well, thank you for not leaving some zombies in the lurch. Uh, you're not just zombies to us. And thank you for accepting us like this. You're family to us. <laughs>